and I am back had to do a little update to the game and shut off all the freaking music because well YouTube you can't do a damn thing because of YouTube I has lost my game again there we go Yes, YouTube flagged the last video because of the in-game music playing in the background. Now, the only control I have of that is to just turn it off. Therefore, you just get a boring game with no middle music to go with it. I mean, it's YouTube. I've never had to deal with such stupidity in my entire life until I dealt with YouTube. All right, let's see. Did I already complete this one? No. Got that one. Winter Truck National. I did not finish. What else I got? And I just got some sort of message or something. Or no, I got energy in... Oh, it's 602. I got energy in my other game. Let's go back. Okay, I'm going to try this drift showcase thing. I don't know. How well I shall do at it. So this is the drift showcase challenge. Race down the short track, turn around at the marker, and come back again. Drifting as much as you can as you go. Your fans are out there watching, so give them a show. Alright, so let's see. I think Q is the handbrake. So I don't know how to manage this. But I'll try. Hey, like there's I a said, few assists which won't do you any favors in this me. drift showcase, so I've turned them off temporarily. If you're used to having them turned on, you might find the car slides a bit easier now, so be careful. That's not how it works. Here we go again. Stop moving. That's not very good. Bomber. Guess I'll see you around. Oh well. I knew I'd suck at that. <laughs> <laughs> 
Let's skip that. Buttermilk time. There's something about head-to-head -head competition that brings out the best in you. Good luck out there. Fans will go nuts when they see that. Let's post it on YouTube. Let's post it on YouTube. You want me to post stuff on YouTube? You know, in the video game, but yet YouTube flags the video. So, whatever. It's stupid. Let me get this straight. This game is in cahoots with YouTube. So I post it to YouTube, and then YouTube flags it for music content, which YouTube more than likely knows is in the game. So I lose either way. Unless I turn the music completely off and just have a game with no music in the background. Because, well, YouTube are dipshits.
You must love the spotlight. You've been doing really well in head-to-head -head events recently. Let's keep it up. frames per second in the hyper speed. Might have to tab out of the game and restart it or something and lock the video cards settings for this game. That's what it was kind of like, like it was in hyperspeed. But if you watch it...
before I go any further, let's. Yes, I want to quit. Called again. I forgot where to find pretty much like it's quite my word. I'm looking for frames for a second and I'm looking to see Set it to sixty. Let's see if that helps. All right. And the else I need to shut off. Full screen only. Try to get it was basically didn't have a limit for frame rate, so now we do. Oh, back in the game. Yes, 
so we can do is try it and hope it helps. Tokyo Classic. I like the Texaco Mobile Rock Cars. What are you doing here, Doug? Huh? What are you doing here, Doug? You think so? Welcome to Shibuya. Neon lights and busy streets define this epic city circuit in one of Tokyo's liveliest districts. You'll be driving in the skid marks of giants and legends from past dirt tours. So get ready to join the elite. That was awesome. You gotta show that to the world. Put it on YouTube. Outstanding podium finish. This will really help raise your driver rate. Not bad, no crashes. And that 
is it? This one? Put that drift one. That was a great last race. Once you got the car under control, you really picked up the pace. Keep that up and you'll grab first today. Brake bias promotes oversteer on the way into a corner, making power sliding easier, but it can reduce braking efficiency. A rear brake bias promotes oversteer on the way into a corner, making power sliding easier, but it can reduce braking efficiency. A rear brake bias promotes oversteer on the way into a corner, yeah, making power sliding easier, but it can reduce braking efficiency. Good on this fucking thing either. Smashing blocks, so. huh? Okay, ready for your big surprise? I want you to meet your new Jim Conn instructor, three times X Games medalist and YouTube sensation, racing superstar Ken Block. <laughs> Hey, what's up? 
If you haven't seen this guy's videos, you're missing out on some really sick driving. Ken is the best gym kind of driver on the planet, and he's also one of the sport's biggest innovators. He single-handedly raised the profile of the sport. <laughs> Come on, Christian, you're making me blush. Just telling you how it is, my amigo. Okay. So once you learn how to do Gymkhana, we'll start setting challenges for you. So be sure to pay attention to everything Ken says. All right, let's get you out there and up to speed. This is going to be fun. Nice. Welcome to Gymkhana School, Ken Block style. What better way to begin gym kind of training than by smashing things? What's this all about, Ken? Well, smash blocks is the simplest trick you can learn about. Just drive into them and you'll get points for each one you smash. Simple as that. Maximum destruction. All right, Ken's showing you how it's done. Just smash enough blocks to get a bronze medal and move on to the next tutorial. Go smash it. Amigo, mucho mucho grande Gymkhana skills. Whatever. This, this whole thing is not me. Now this is what I'm talking about. Jumps and getting tons of air. Any tips for our driver, Ken? Well, they're really pretty easy. The trick is to find the right line for the jump. Get as much speed as you dare for some big air time. Be careful, though, as you'll need to keep it under control on the landing. So the further you fly, the higher the score. Look out for the triangles and tell you how well you did. Three triangles means you aced the trick and got maximum points. Damn it! They need to give me more options for my controls. Awesome, man. I knew you'd be great at this. Get on with it. I've had enough, you guys. I'm gonna fail it anyway. Ah, drifting. That's how you get the crowd going. Tell us how it's done, Ken. 
Okay, these are drift gates. There's a few different kinds, but they all work the same way. Just slide through them fast and with the car at an angle. The faster and the more sideways you drift through the gate, the more points you'll score. Awesome. Go get your slide on, amigo. Gymkhana star. That was a huge fail because I, I can't do this with my hands. They don't work that way anymore. Enough, and the buttons are too close together for my big fingers. Now, spin zones look impossible to me. A real demonstration of precision driving. What's the trick of pulling these off, Ken? Well, the spin zone's actually one of my favorite tricks. You need to drive into the marked area and get the car into a controlled spin. The more you spin, the more you'll score. The key is to approach slowly and at an angle. Then turn in and use the handbrake to get the back end out. Keep your foot on the gas and steer hard to keep it going. The longer the spin, the higher you score. If you max it out or start getting dizzy, just straighten up and drive off. The crowds love this stuff. was a sick performance. You totally can do this without the trick steer assist. Why don't you try turning it off the next time you're in the service area? You can always turn it back on later if you think you need it. I didn't know I had to assist. That's what I just did. What's the difference?
Is that what I just did? Fancy a donut? In the world of Jim Connor, that word means something entirely different, right, Ken? Yeah, we've got big and small donuts here. They may look different, but they all work the same way. You just need to pull up a smooth, sideways drift around the central object. To get started, drive up like you're going past the trick, then get your car sideways by turning in hard and using the handbrake. Next, balance the throttle and the steering to keep your nose as close to the center as possible while you spin. Remember, you can only score points off the Mark Gymkhana Donuts. They look pretty tricky, but I got faith. Better get to it. Okay, try it again. Right this time, try to connect with your inner chem block. Oh, fuck off. I've had enough of this dumbass fucking crap. Get me out of here. No, I had enough of this dumb shit. Fucking controls are fucking retarded. For a keyboard. No, let me the fuck out of it. Just the way the whole game is set up. You can just, qualify the final with a second place finish. At all, period. I'm tired enough just to play this kind of game the way I'm playing it. So if I can ex try to explain it, I'm left-handed. So this is the hand that I need to do all this stuff on because it's a little more coordinated than this hand. But all the controls are on this hand because they're way over here. Everything that I have way over here for a left-hand person doesn't work with this fucking game.
imagine how much better I could play if I was using the proper hand. Proper control. This is a good step towards the final. Keep it up. Good. I'm glad it's a step toward the final. I've got to finish this up and I'm going to tab out since there's a way to change all this shit. This is retarded. I got this here and I can't use it and it's for my proper hand. Qualified for the final. Nicely done. Who's hoping we see you on the podium? Alright, let's do this. And I've lost my mouse. There we go. Yes, I watch YouTube a lot.
basically what this is saying is I'm basically fucked. This is me right here. I have the gamepad. No, we we'll talk about a whole different thing. No, I don't. Never mind. Yeah, I know if I had a wheel, but I can't afford that. I had an impossible to play without a wheel. I was fine when I had to turn corners, but just trying to keep car straight making that's what I'm having issues with because you can't control the gas you can't control the brake you can't control the steering without it going one way too fast or one way too slow or left too quick or right too quick and you just lose the vehicle This guy must have pretty quick hands or he's got his keyboard. Two keyboards or something going here. I don't know what the hell he's doing. Which I could technically do. I got another keyboard. But and my computer actually does do it. Let's see. Keyboard controls. PC controller setup. How to set up a controller. Why the hell someone be using a steering wheel for third person shooters? <laughs> yes, I'm thinking of something else. Let's see what this is. Let's uh, highlight this. Search for what the hell is this? Oh, never mind. It's just what I call a paddle. They call it a controller. So, basically, what I've seen out of just these two short posts is. Without a steering wheel, this game is pretty much impossible to play properly. Steering wheel and pedals, that is. And there's, I guess, no way to change the keyboard layout. So, this is all I can do. So, forget that shit. Do the best that I can with this. Hmm. 
Ich habe auch zu viel zu sehen. So I'll stick to this style of racing for now. You've been doing great in Rallycross this season. Let's keep that momentum going. Look, I got a shave again. Getting fuzzy. Need a haircut too.
Welcome to Monte Carlo. They've been racing here for a century now, but the competition's still just as intense. The tracks are tight and twisty, with unpredictable road conditions making this more than your average asphalt challenge. Win here, and you'll have conquered the granddaddy of rally races. That's why.
That was a tough one, but you passed with flying colours. Yeah, right. Rally is absolutely your event. Let's see another podium.
makes it hard to play when the truck is doing that. God, it fucks with my eyes. I'm very impressed by your driving. Getting on that podium really helps increase your profile. I'll tell you to be careful out there.
<laughs> that must have been a wreck at the end. I have this one too. Don't know what Dirt Showdown is. It's probably the same thing. So under F. downloading. How long is that going to take? 12, 10, 8. So that's going to take a bit. So, well actually it's been six minutes. Three new items in my inventory. Trading cards. About the dumbest you can get. What else do I have? Don't know what this is. Darkness. See that there? I need a controller. Cyclonauts, Rising Storm. Is 
civilization. Psychonauts. Fifty-one percent. So how far along? Two minutes till I can play it. Didn't know I downloaded that. Must have done it on its own. One minute forty four seconds so we can see what their showdown is all about. <sighs> yes, I have yet to buy that. Installed, 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 installed. Yes, it's all there. Oh, under a minute. I haven't played that for a while either. And I've never played the stupid Fallout Shelter thing. Tell Star Point Gemini is. Four seconds. Let's hit this all up. Oh, completing installation. Give it a minute. Why well, you install on DirectX? It's already got DirectX, whatever. It is. it would seem my streaming service decided to crash. Okay, 
Alright, first things first. No. Oh, come on, I need to get rid of the fucking music. Details, you're not getting. Yeah, I know. It's already going to YouTube, dumbasses. I'll be called Captain. Okay. Music has got to go, because if it doesn't go... If I don't get rid of the music, YouTube will have a fucking hissy fit. some e juice in my e sink and that bottle's empty. Alright Nevada, things are getting tense as we find out who's gonna make it through to the Dirt Showdown Tour. I have no idea what this is. Look at this. It yeah, looks like a giant demolition dirt. So you all go and see some carnage. These drivers are looking hot, but you guys are even hotter. Okay. It's history in the making, people. Watch and learn. Okay, well, what do I get to play? There's the road. Showdown style. 
have no idea what I just did, other than went around in a big figure eight. Oh yeah, we have our winners. That's them through to the showdown tour. It's been a blast, people. See you after the break. Awesome race. You've shown you've got the skills, and now it's time for the real thing. Welcome to Dirt Showdown. Pick an option, and let's get this party started. Right. Before I go picking anything, I'm going to put some juice in my e sick beer bag. That's right, you're not having any of my pepperoni there, pooch. Go away. Alright, let's see what this game is all about. Oh, I can't use that. Well, it put me on this Where one, shall so... Where we keep this off? Miami or San Francisco? Where should I go, guys? Miami or San Francisco? Get out of my crotch, dog, because you're not having any pepperoni. Guess we're going to pepperoni. Miami's going to be killer. Pick your car. Ooh, I like crotch. Better get your look sorted before you head out there. Snap on racing. Sweet. I'll be rooting for you. And yes, I filled this. I like traps.
Hey now. Oh, right, this one was mutt. Dang, this one's dumber. I like this game. Not like the other game. Guys. Welcome to Joyride, a playground full of missions, tricks, and big air opportunities. Go!
like this utter destruction. You get the son of a bitch. everything is all I can say. Let us steer well, this is pretty much out of control.
dumb ass game. I really need to steer with control any of this game. Yes, I want to quit. This game is just, it's too stupid to even try to control. I don't even know what it's still downloading. Let's go something a little more my speed. Eventually, I gotta go get something to eat for supper. Well, where the fuck am I? Portland. Friday is Wednesday. Not giving you anything either, Olivia. No, neither one of you are getting anything. You talked to the, both the dogs that they're in here because I had pepperoni. And I swear to God, they can spell it from a mile away. I want to go to Seattle. That's where I want to go. I guess I'll just have to drive there on my own. <laughs> They're empty. Yeah, 
That would be my new garage I'm about to open up. Yes, I want to buy this garage. Oh, yes, yes. Have a recruitment agency. Let's hire me. I'm going to hire Sebastian.
Now we got a full garage and drivers. Now I need to do the map. Why is my mouse active? So, because I need to go for a ride to Seattle. And yes, there'll be no music in this because, like, yeah, you too. I will probably be speeding a lot. Because hopefully I'll be able to get there without any damages. Or funny glitches like I had earlier today playing this game. fast enough to drift it sideways or anything like that like the other day. Still 103 miles an hour in a cracked trailer. <laughs> We 
least in this game, I can drive it without putting a steering wheel in, even though it would be nicer to have a steering wheel. Could have been bad. I do believe I would might have gone a little sideways on that one. Seven miles to my destination. Did it without actually having an accident. Just a little bit annoyed. Just as I get here. Nothing put. Nothing put. I'm not going to set this garage up too much. I'm just going to purchase it and I'll deal with it later. I keep saying that. I got garages all over the goddamn place now. <laughs> Red tricon inside. Did they do a patch to this game? Come on, let me in. Really now. 
I don't need any repairs, but... Hmm. Salt Lake, Seattle, San Rafael, Seattle to Manchester, New Hampshire. Wow. Empty bottles. Fragile. <laughs> I don't know if I want to drive all the way to Fayetteville, North Carolina tonight. It's a long fucking ride. So is Manchester, New Hampshire. Salt Lake's pretty goddamn long too. I wanted to go here. But I don't see nothing for Spokane. Hmm. Anything to pick up in Spokane? A road roller? Let's see our Vista, Arizona. Some stuff in St. Louis. Yeah, see, I have not discovered this. Therefore, it's not here. I have discovered Portland. Hold up, bites. I really do not want to go down there yet. Alright, I guess on that note, I'm going to call this enough for the moment. What I'm going to do is sign off from my live stream for the night, get myself something to eat and just drive around in the game. I'll catch you all later. Thank you for watching. Please watch out some of my other videos if you'd like. You know, like, subscribe, or leave some comments. I appreciate it. Thank you. Goodbye.